guys, it's Danny. Today I'm here with one of my best friends, Abby. Hi guys. <laughs> and she actually has a channel here on YouTube. She is Abby Zucker. I will link her channel down her below. Basic. She does makeup tutorials and little fun things. She has a story time. I do some random stuff. Yeah, guys. she does. Some so, random stuff. She's doing vlogging now. Mm -hmm. Today we're doing a video that is kind of like nightlife and NYC. We're going out dancing, and so we got all like dressed up. We got awesome. these cute outfits on. <laughs> we did our makeup, so we did kind of like a chit chat, get ready with me, and we're just gonna show you guys how we did our makeup and our outfits for tonight. On my channel, we are doing a vlog, so I'm gonna take you guys with us when we're at the club and when we're dancing. Oh. Yeah, so if you guys wanna see what it's like to be a college student in NYC and going out as like an FIT student, then this is it. This is you gotta it. go. Don't believe that fashion kids can't have fun. Oh, no, no, no. Because no, we no, get no. it. <laughs> Let's jump into it. Let's get Let's go. into it. It's already moisturized. Moisturized our skin. <laughs> I just got stuff from Sephora. I always start with this. It's like a NYX first base primer. It's almost out, literally. <laughs> just bought this Too Faced Hangover RX <laughs> primer. Abby already uses this one, but oh, I didn't know it has this cute little like squeeze. It's so cute. It's so convenient. I'm gonna what? use the Stila One Step Correcting Primer. <laughs> And then I might use a little bit of the hangover on like oh the God, outside of my face. Oh so good. I literally rub this all over my face. So this is the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Foundation. This is the CoverGirl Ready Set Gorgeous and I'm in the lightest shade 105 Classic Ivory. <laughs> <laughs> you classic ivory. Hey. This is Fair Neutral. It's the lightest shade. <laughs> Don't judge wondering. me for being the lightest shade too. Do you put this on your beauty blender or do you? I dot it on my face, but I don't put anything on my beauty blender. I always dot it on my face. How do you do this? I feel like this is like a two hour makeup challenge because like that's- <laughs> It's gonna take me so long. I know, it takes me so long to get ready. Uh, I can't even get it out. Yeah, well you have to put it in and then click it. Uh huh. Let go and then pull it up and then click it. God, it's like that you used in science. I know, it's literally it's like a beaker. Is that what it's called? No. Beaker. The beaker is the, the <laughs> container. It's um. A, oh! oh. <laughs> This is the LA Girl Pro Conceal Concealer, and this is once again in the lightest color of porcelain, because, you know, we're tasty. <laughs> this concealer is bomb, and it's really cheap, too. Shape Tip Concealer. Love this stuff. I'm so jealous. I want you it. You to get this. It's I only at Ulta, it. though. I know. That's why it's I annoying. miss Ulta. Not mm -hmm. having Ulta too. in New York is, like, such a buzzkill. But I, when I went home, I picked this up. I put it in, like, really weird spots while I highlight, but then I like to put it under my brows when oh. I when I don't like have them plucked very nice because it just feels like it looks like it smart. cleans them up. For powder, I use the MAC Studio Fix in NW15 and then because that's like really pale, I'll use the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Powder, which is like really dark. Just like kind of a bronze, but like I kind of just put it all over my face. Hey, no, no. 
This is the Laura Mercier translucent setting powder. For my eyebrows, I like using my Anastasia dip brow pomade in taupe and then I usually use this to like outline like the tail and then I'll use my NYX micro brow pencil in taupe to like fill it in and then I set it with my L'Oreal brow plumper. This is amazing. It has fibers in it so it makes your eyebrows look so thick. It's bomb. This is the Too Faced Cocoa Powder and it's a foundation but I just use it to sit my face um, on the areas that aren't set already. Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade, but in the shade Soft Brown. Oh, really? Yes. That's shocking. Cause my hair's like dark in here. Yeah, I know. I don't know why I use this one. I don't know. And then when I used yours, I was like, wow, this color's really nice. But I use that for like the majority of my brow, like the arch and stuff, and just like creating the outline. And I fill it in until like about right here. And then I use Powder by Urban Decay. Looks like this. And it comes in two shades. I use the latest one. I'm going to move on to my eyes. I'm gonna use the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette because it's my faves. I'm gonna use this color right here, the white chocolate. I'm gonna put this all over my lid and then I'm probably gonna take a mixture of milk chocolate and salted caramel. Caramel? How do you say it? Caramel, caramel or caramel? Caramel. Me too! Oh my God. Lorac Pro Palette. The what? Lorac. 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 Lorac Rock. In the lightest shade, literally called white. I'm putting it just on my lid. Some ColourPop Super Shock Shadows. This one's in Fringe and then the other one's in I Heart This. They're like, one of them's gold and one of them's a little bit more silver and I just like mixing the two. Putting this shade called Taupe. It's the third one over. All over the lid. Hey, no, 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 no. I'm gonna go in with sable. I'm going to line my tight line and my waterline with my Stila smudge stick waterproof eyeliner. In this beautiful garnet shade, it's so pretty. Oh it's like God. a brick color. I'm like using the NYX matte liquid liner, I'm just gonna do. And now I'm doing 
doing mascara. I'm going to go back in to like the inner, just the white, brighten it up. I'm going to use my Anastasia contour kit and I'm going to take these two colors and then just put that under my eyes just to brighten it. I'm using my It Cosmetics Vitality face disc and I'm taking the bronzer color. I'm going to start with the choke color on my lower lash line. Becca Champagne Pop Highlighter That's Broken, just like my relationship. We all know! Making it chill tonight with eyeliner. This came in my uh, Nick Tutorials Art of Makeup Is it good? kit. I love it. Yeah. I love it. It's the Too Faced um, sketch marker. So that's what it looks like. <laughs> same two shades that Abby went in with and just brightening up all the places where I highlighted with concealer. For eyelashes, I'm going to use my Violet Voss lashes and these are an I Donut Care. <laughs> So this is the Too Faced Sweethearts Bronzer. It's really pretty like shimmer. It's so oh, cute. I wanted to try that. Got my glue for my lashes. I'm gonna use the Ardell Lash Grip Lash Adhesive. I'm using her blush brush. Great! Oh my god. I don't wear brush. I don't wear brush. I don't wear brush. This is the Tarte Captivating Blush. This is an Amazonian clay. 12 hour blush. So I usually make this really funny face when I put on blush and you're about to witness. This is lovely. It's time for lips. Ooh. I'm just gonna use Max Velvet Teddy because I'm basic. Look how like low it is. I'm using the ColourPop lippy stick in the shade She Bad. This is their Matte X formula. Oh my. Guys, I stained my shirt. I have a little friend, and this was the play. Like, yeah. Now to top it off, I'm using my Buxom lip gloss. I talked about this in my favorite video. This is in the shade Samantha. Shout out to my sister, because that's her Aww. name. That's nice.
forget to leave a like and subscribe down below. Hit also, that button. <laughs> don't forget to subscribe to Abby's channel if you haven't already because her videos are amazing and I love her. We are a package, mm -hmm. aka more vids to come. So if you guys want to see more videos collabing with the two of us, then make sure to comment down below what you guys want to see Give and us some feedback. Oh, yeah, we hope you guys liked it and we'll see you next time. Bye.